What is going on, YouTube? This is your boy. This is Creative Life. Got something special for y'all today. Got something special for y'all today. Again, shout outs to my, my boy Rich. Coming through in crunch time. So y'all can see that box right there. These are the off white Jordan 5s. I don't know if y'all can see that. Should be able to see that, right? Wait, it's kind of bright. Hey, wait, wait, wait. There you go. So it's a nine and a half. Uh, I was standing outside downtown Chicago um, on, I think it was Saturday, standing in line um, at House of Hoops. I was able to get, again, to wait. Can I go House of Hoops? I was able to get my girl uh, the Jordan 1 UNC 2 Chicago. Uh, this is not her size. But I'm going to, you know, swap these out and get her size. For her. I know I've already showed y'all the review of these, so I'm just going to show y'all again. I like these. But she has been getting some offers on them. So I'm going to see what she's going to do. I didn't put these back. Yes, I was able to get these for her. But while I was standing in line, this All-Star Weekend, again, I wasn't really, like, too picky about what I wanted. I just had a few options. I was thinking either the Jordan 6 Travis Scott that was supposed to be released but didn't release. And I was also thinking about what else? Off-white Jordan 5s, which I was able to get, or the Unite 3s. Let me scoot back a little bit. Uh, so as I was standing in line, 10 o'clock hit. It was time for the raffle. The draw, not the raffle. I put it in on my app. Everybody outside put it in on their app. And I called my homie. He was like, man, could you put it in a size 9.5 for me if you're not going to put them in? He said, all right, I got you because he didn't want them. And he was able to hit on his app, and I wasn't. Uh, but it still came through in crunch time for me. Uh, let's go ahead and get this, this box. And let's go over these real quick. So, I am excited. I'm kind of kind of happy about these. I'm going to go ahead and show y'all the bag. As y'all can see. Got the jump man on the bag. And the bag also says uh, off-white. Off-white. Y2013, so I'm guessing Off-White in the year 2013 is when Off-White started. Uh, well, or was it established or whatever. Let's get these, oof, let's get these joints out the, out the box. All right, and again, the box does have holes in them. Uh, not too sure why the box has holes in it, but I think it's pretty cool. It's different. So it's pretty much all around the box, if y'all can see. Like, look, cutouts. That's just what the tag is. And also up here. So, let's get to these joints, man. Like, I think these are fire. And we here in Chicago, we don't normally say fire. We normally say shit fire. So, excuse my language, but I'm going to say these joints is fire, man. I like them a lot. This is what I'm going to probably use as a birthday shoe. Uh, inside here is, uh, says the normal script. The uh, Off-White. Um, Off-White for Nike. Air Jordan 5. Beaverton, Oregon. 1990. It's inside of there. If you can see that. Okay. Uh, back. Nike Air. Um, inside the tongue, should have a uh, air drawing upside down. If y'all can see that, um, yeah, shoelaces, <laughs> say shoelaces, if y'all can see that as well. That's, that's wicked. Um, the little lace lock is already like worn. I don't want to say worn, I'm gonna say aged. So I'll give it like a little, a little milky look to it. I think that's decent. Uh, extra laces. One red, one white. So yeah, I, I, I dig these. Same thing on this end. 
Let's see the remedial side. Like it here on the back. Got the hang tag. Hang tag, say off white zip tie in 2020. Off white CO Nike 2020 zip tie, as y'all can see. But yeah, I think these are a nice shoe, man. Um, hold on. Yeah, I am excited about these. I like these. I didn't think I was going to like them that much, but they look better in hand, in my opinion. And I like that the sole is uh, kind of aged. But I think, and, I, and this is just my thought process, I think with Virgil, the way he was going as far as his Jordans and stuff, it's basically to look like a sketch of what they were supposed to be. So this is the unfinished product. It's like, this is just a sketch of it. And if you leave an unfinished product, especially something with an icy sole, it turns yellow. And a lot of people like uh, yellow soles. So I think that's pretty awesome. Uh, these are tags, say, eh? made in China. You can see that as well. I'm sorry, this, this light is like bright. Um... Now, a lot of people, oh, I like that too, I got through the hole in there. <laughs> a lot of people were cutting out this hole with an X-Acto knife and this hole. I'm not, I'm not gonna cut them, I'm, I'm gonna leave them like they are. I like these joints, I, I think these, I think these are hit. I really like them. Yep, and I was supposed to get the black metallic fives from the Nike outlet in Oak Brook, me and my homie Richard, we had a chance to get them. They was in the, in the outlet for, I think, like $163. And we didn't get them. We ended up getting some different shoes. I think I ended up getting a Trophy Room Jordan 17s from the outlet on the south side of Chicago on 87. I think I paid one something for those. But I kind of regret it to an extent because I'm like, man, I could have just got the metallic fives but now i have uh reimagined metallic five or a sketch of a metallic five so you know here we go off-white jordan fives like i said these joints ain't coming out probably until my birthday because everybody and they mom's gonna rock theirs and beat them up y'all know me man i like to keep my stuff until later man when everybody wear theirs and do they thing. But these are hit though. I ain't gonna lie, no cap. These here is a hit. Oh, and uh I think the price was eleven thirty seven on StockX for these, but then the price dropped. I think the price had dropped down to probably like nine hundred dollars now. The price is going down, but I think after this week, after everybody get their pairs, I think that price is gonna go all the way back up. So Y'all gonna get them, get them while they low. Um, I don't like paying resale for nothing. Thank God I didn't have to pay resale for these. With taxes, I paid two thirty nine fourteen or fifty seven or something like that. Whatever's whatever, but I'm just very appreciative that I didn't have to pay that resale because I wasn't gonna pay a thousand dollars for no shoes. I mean, I make YouTube videos, but I ain't getting YouTube money yet. So <laughs> no man, but again, I really do like these joints. Off white fives. Again, I showed y'all my, my old lady shoes. Uh yeah. Thanks again to my homie. You know who you are. Thanks, Rich, for putting this on the app for me. And I was able to get these joints. Because again, I struck out. But now I got them. Now I got them. So I want y'all to like, comment, and subscribe, man. I'm gonna continue trying to do videos. I am trying to be a little bit more consistent, but I still got other things going on in life. Oh man, the exposed part. I didn't show y'all that. This is exposed, like it's cut open around here. That's wicked. I think that that was on the other ones as well. I think that was on my terracotas that I got as well. But yeah, I'm sorry about that, man. Y'all like, comment, subscribe. Uh, mess with your boy, man. I'm trying to get my subscribers up, my subscribers up, I'm trying to get my views up, I'm trying to do my thing. So, all I say is your boy Jay. This is Creative Life. I got those fives. Y'all be smart.